Hey guys, hope you are doing excellent. Now, I'm going to show you how you will create easily an illustration for kids book cover. Okay, I have taken a size of our board and it is 6 by 9 inch. And I have taken two files and this one. From here, I will create a book cover. Okay, I'm taking it here. And what I'll do, I'll select all of the files. And after that, I'll check it in the layers that it is locked or unlocked. It is unlocked. And now, I will directly take it to my artboard where I will create a book cover. So, I'll select that and right click. After that, I'll see here it is grouped or ungrouped. There is no group. They have done the clipping mask. I'll click here and create release clipping mask. And left click anywhere. And now, you can select the object one by one. This is the kids. This is the Santa Claus and this is the tree. Okay, so we can get it part by part. This is my background. Well, I'm pressing Ctrl Z. I'll select the whole background and take it here. Then it will be easy for me to ungroup the designs. Well, I have. Kept few backgrounds also okay no problem and uh, what I'll do I'll take this tree and take it out how it looks okay I have got with the tree with the shadow also okay now I have to work few things here. If I ungroup it, if I click and ungroup, click anywhere and I'll delete the shadows. I don't need it anymore. Okay. I just need this one. And from here, these colors I don't need, this lighting I don't need. Okay. And the kid shadow also, I don't need that. And I need the background. So this is another shape and this one. Actually this one I need. Okay. I will take it here. And after that I will make it as a background from a book cover. Okay. Okay, I'm pressing control Z. Uh, what can I do? Okay, I'm increasing the size because I want this lighting. That means gradient. I want this gradient. So I'll place it here. I want to take the kids here. Okay, and I'll press Control minus. Hmm, it's perfect. Uh, now I'll press Control plus or I'll press and hold the Alt key and scroll the wheel of my mouse. And then I have to check in the downside is perfect or not. No, it's not perfect. Yes, now the gaps are okay. So I'll press Control minus, and what I have to do? Mm, I'll take the line tool. I have to go to the object path, divide objects below, and I will create the line again. 
object path divide objects below okay now i'll take the selection tool select one by one and delete it huh? i have got my gradient there okay no problem it's okay let's do with that Um, if I take it here, okay, and draw on it. This mass size is okay, and where is the kids? Kids will come here, okay. And my Santa Claus. I will take him here. No, he didn't get the ground because legs are a little bit up. Okay. And If I take this here, well, I'll go to that illustration and I have to check this out the shadows and if I take the table, let's work with the table. Mm. If I ungroup that, select it and delete it. No, I can't delete that because I have to ungroup more. Click ungroup. If I delete this one and this one also, no, no, I'm taking that because it will not adjust there. Right click and ungroup. Delete. Delete. Okay, now I'll take it here. The gifts will stay here. I'll keep here. And then for the kids, uh, I want to take a floor. And uh, this is the floor. Okay, I have to take it up. Okay, if I take it from here, uh, there is no floor and this also. Okay, and more things what we can take. If I take this one, how we to look? Let's check this out. It's not too much highlighting. Okay, no, I'm I'm keeping it simple. I'll delete that. I don't need the table. This also, I don't need this anything. Okay, I'll go to there again. I'm taking it again. Now I have to check and right click and release clipping mask. Okay, and from here, I'll take this down 
and select this one delete it okay if I take the floor and keep it here I have to send them to the backward Control Z, and if I take that and this one also, uh, as a floor, it's not sitting very much. Okay, let's take this one in this side. Okay, let's do this. Select. I'm selecting the background and I'm selecting all of them. Take it in the downside. Okay, now it's looking good. Mm, okay. And I'm taking them up. This is the shadow, the bag, and this is the shadow of the Santa Claus. Taking the shadow in the right side a little bit, decreasing the size of the shadow of the bag. Okay. It's okay, and I have to send it back. Hmm, no, it's still in front of the bag. Okay, it has gone. No. Hmm, now it's perfect, and I select that and I have to send it to the backward. I'll, I'm pressing Ctrl and fast Kali bracket. Okay, it has got in the downside and Ctrl minus. Now I'll take the line tool and create a straight line from here. Object, uh, path, and divide objects below. Take the selection tool, click anywhere, select that, and select this one, right click, undo, and select this, and delete it. Control, Control, zero. Yes, and uh, if I take this shadow, And place it here in the back side. Increase it.
Okay, I'm taking it in the left side. Too much left. A little bit right. Okay, it's okay. Um, but the problem is that, okay, if I take this time a rectangle here, if I select all of the three and if I apply the art fender, what happens? The right click on group, clicking anywhere. Yes, I have got that. I have got the color. Well, I'll select that and press Ctrl and first curly bracket. Yes, I'm getting the designs. Okay, and uh, I don't need that anymore. I'll delete it. I'll select all of them and take it here. There is another background. This is, I, I locked that. I'll press Ctrl Alt 2 and delete that. Delete it now. I'll select all of them and take it here. Control plus. Okay, and now mm, I have to write down the text. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, and I have a uh, few text. which is a uh, Christmas text. Merry Christmas. Hello Christmas, I'm taking this one and take the size uh, 50. Well, this text is so good. Merry Christmas. And um, the color of the text uh, should be like that. Okay, let's make it um, shape first. And okay. Okay, the eyedropper tool. Hmm. If I apply this one, this color, yes, uh, this is good, but uh, I want to make it more highlight. If I take uh, this gray, hmm. I need the white actually. This one, no, 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 no. Oh, the different types of color and um, well, if I directly take white, let's check out. No, no, no. Okay, this is good. Merry Christmas. Uh, if you want to write, if you want, you can uh, write down the write on them. Oh, I can't write down because uh, I have made this as a shape and uh, I'll place it here. I'll write down nothing. And this is uh, okay if I it's looking good. And uh, I'll go to the file after that uh, save as. Um, e Merry 
Christmas. Oh, I have saved it as Arab Illustrator. I wanted to save it as um, EPS. No problem. I'm saving it again. I'll save as. No, okay. It's saving. It will take a little bit time. We can see the progress here saving. 95%. Mm, it has saved. I'll go to the file. Um, okay. EPS Now go to the file again File Export save for web and save. I will go to my folder. Save it as JPG. I'm done. Guys, uh, did you understood? Our book cover is ready. Yes, sir. Okay, thank you so much.